Welcome to Cadence Design Systems Ideality Tutorial Tuesday, where we show you how to use a feature or demonstrate a technique in just a few minutes. In this video, we will show you how to request a new license file using the Cadence Online Support Portal. The first thing that you're going to have to do is to go to support.cadence.com and you're going to be presented with this page in front of you. At this point, it is assumed that you have already created your account in this portal. If you need more information about how to create this account, please check out the video that is linked in the description. What we're going to do now is to enter our email address and our password to just log into the portal. After you have logged into the portal, you're going to be presented with this particular page. Remember, in this particular video, we're going to show you how to request a license for one of the Cadence Fidelity products. In particular, we're interested in Fidelity Pointwise. To do that, we're going to go to Software, and then you're going to see down here the Order Licenses option. Go ahead and click on it. This page is going to show up and you can see that it's going to present a little bit of information. On the left side, you have all the host IDs that are associated with this particular account. Each host ID is going to be associated with one or more products. On the right side, you're going to see an email field where you can actually specify an email address. The license file that you request is going to be sent to that particular email address. If you don't see listed here the host ID of interest, you're going to have to use this host ID option that you see right here in the form of a link. Go ahead and click on that one. I'm going to open this in a new tab and you will see that a pop-up window is going to show up like this one right here where you're going to be able to specify the new host ID of interest that you would like to link to this particular account. Once you enter the host ID, you're going to click on the Add Host ID button, and then done. What you have here in front of you is your profile page in case you would like to make any additional changes. In this case, we're not interested in making any additional changes, so I'm going to go ahead and close this particular tab. If you refresh this particular page, the new host ID that you have added is now going to be listed. Since we're interested in requesting a new license file for Fidelity Pointwise, the very last host ID is the one that has this product associated with it. So go ahead and click on Show Releases, and you can see this little table is going to show up. The left column shows the release name, and the right column shows all the versions that are available. Keep in mind that when talking about Fidelity Pointwise, you're going to have listed here uh, version 18.6. This is the legacy version of Fidelity Pointwise that actually uses the Reprise License Manager. If you're interested in running the latest and greatest that Pointwise has to offer, the latest release, go ahead and always select the highest version number that you see available on this table. In this case, that is 22.2. Once you select the highest version number that you have available and you have specified the email address in this particular field, go ahead and click Submit Order. Your order is going to be submitted, processed, and once the license file is actually generated, it will be emailed to you to that particular address that you have specified. If you like this video, be sure to click the thumbs up button and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, drop us a line down below or connect with us on LinkedIn, which is linked in the description. Thank you all, and have a pleasant Tuesday.